issue she raised about ministers. Um, yes. That's the first one. Secondly, with your permission, ma'am, can I block the chat group for now uh, so that we... Thank you very much. Uh, thank you very much, uh, Mr. Don't, Castle. Block, don't block the chat group. Tell that woman to stop her nonsense. That's all. She no, must no, not no, think no, 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 you're no, no, her no. workers here. Honorable members, honorable members. Go back to military training. Go oh, back to school where a fake lawyer degree. You can't can tell us anything. Go act like a white person. You're nothing but a fake one. You're a fake white person. Yeah, we must block some of these members from the group completely. No, honorable members. Honorable members. We are adults here. Not only are we adults, we are leaders of our parties. I do not think we should conduct ourselves in the manner in which you are doing, Honorable uh, Mkalipi and Honorable uh, Mazon. I do not think it is correct to use the kind of language you are using on this platform. We are honorable members. Not only are we sitting here in this meeting, but we are also, it, this meeting tends to be very big and I know that it is an open meeting and therefore you also have people who are not necessarily coming from political parties who join this meeting, for instance, from, from, from the members of the media. I do not think it is correct of us to conduct ourselves in such an irresponsible manner. I take a serious exception to the kind of language which members use on a platform of this nature. And I do want us to refrain from doing that, honorable members. I do want us to refrain from doing that. And I do want to really make the point that if it happens again, honorable members, I will request those who are co-hosting here to, re to, 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 to remove, to take you out, to lock you out of the system. Honorable. Thank you, honorable Imam Sheikh, honorable Nchangwini. Thank, thank you very much, uh, um, speaker. Uh, speaker, you know this matter, I've been persisting each and every meeting, and if you can go and take all of the recordings of all of the programming committees and the chief whips meetings, the Honorable uh, Mazoni have been guilty every time an EFF member is speaking, then she goes to the chat and throw the jabs there in the chat. And it's unfortunate that when we respond, it's only uh, then taken up with us because we are responding. And that is wrong. I mean, we have been calling each other battalion since with the inception of, 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 of this term, the 44 battalion. And it have never been a problem. So I don't know why all of a sudden, now that is now noted today as an unacceptable language to call the EFF the 44 battalion. It's not an unparliamentary word. And she does it all the time. So go to the chat rooms, throw jabs each and every meeting after every time an EFMF member is speaking. She do, does it her work to go to that meetings and uh, or to go to that chat and to do uh, the jabs there. And then when we respond, it's now us that is the sinners that are responding. And, and, and it's very problemsome that she uh, does that and she gets away with it. And then it's the EFF that must take the fall uh, when it responds to her abuse that she's doing in this chat rooms. We have said to her many a times, this chat room is not your chat room. It's not your house. Stop doing this thing that you are doing in this chat, chat rooms. And she persists that and she does that all the time. And that is how white supremacists are. They do those things. And then when you are responding, you will unfortunately, because your skin is not the favorite skin in our country because you are black and then you are getting attacked. So she mustn't do that. It's okay. very painful 
what she's doing. She mustn't do that. Okay. She mustn't do that. Honorable, okay, Honorable Changwini. Honorable members, I think we've noted that. No more use of the chat group. If there's any matter to be noted or observation to be made, it will be made honestly here in, on the platform by a member. Because I must say that most of the time I do miss what is uh, on the chat because I've not been reading the chats. I think I've read the chat once or twice. To, this is the second time. So I do want to request honorable members once more that you see now that which is coming out of Jamwini, it, it perceives, it, it, it's going to be perceived as a, a real divided uh, programming committee. Yes, honorable members, we are here representing political parties. And I do not want at any point to be making statements and at, at one another and or insults or even jabs for that matter, which may suggest that there are racial divisions in the programming committee. I, I really hate that. And, and therefore, I do want with all due respect and Honorable Mazzoni, I see your hand is up and I'm not going to allow you to talk to this matter. All that I am use this kind of language of, of, of course, we're not the same skin. Of course, we're not the same color. But we are the same blood and we are here representing our members. And please let us stop these jabs. It's not necessary, honorable members. I will not allow it. And as I have said, the co-hosts will then have to throw people out because they, they tend to prolong the meeting and, and it's strenuous, honorable members. It is strenuous. We can't be retrogressing instead of moving. Let's move forward. And sometimes this matter may be actually perceived as a, as a personal clash between two or three people. It's not right. This is not a meeting meant for that. And I'm saying this with all due respect to both yourself, Honorable Mazzoni and Honorable Jamwini. It's not going to happen again. We will not entertain it because I do not think it is correct for other members to be subjected to this unhealthy exchange or dialogue amongst yourselves. It can't be correct. I now proceed. We're not going to discuss this matter again. I'm not going to recognize your hand, Honorable Mazzoni. You have spoken twice at this meeting on one matter. I will now, together with your hand,